This is a walkthrough for tagging a Word document. To begin, select the DDPs tab, choose the DDP, and then open up the field tagger. Ensure that the document type is selected for Word, and then access your document. Either open it up your desktop or double click the file in the Select Files grid to take you directly to the location of your file within the Documents tab. You can then select View File to view your file from your desktop. Once you have your Word file open, you can select a location where you'd like to place a tag, choose your main object, and then the field you'd like to include in your document. You can drag and drop your field into your document, and alternatively, you can copy and paste your field into your document. If you want to switch objects, select the main object dropdown and choose a separate object. A list of fields will appear from the new object so you can include them in your document. Continue doing this as necessary, and then when you are done, save your Word document and upload or re-upload it to Salesforce. If you want to replace a current document, you can select the Replace button and then choose a Word file from your desktop. Once it's replaced or uploaded, ensure that it's inside of the DDP and run it from a test record. Select the Loop Plus button, choose the DDP and a contact if necessary, and select Run. Download your output file to the desktop and open it up to ensure that the merge tags were successfully compiled. If data has come in, then the tagging process is complete. However, if you still see ranges with angle brackets, you must recompile the DDP. And that is how you tag a Word document. Thank you.